Hello, hello friends. It's Danny here of Danny's Dreams. It is day five of my Tag-A-Day November. So let's get into what I used today. <clears throat> the stamp set that I used is this super, super cute one, Hug It Out by My Favorite Things. Um, so many cute, cute uh, stamps in this. I could have made tags all day, but I had to just stop because I have some other projects I need to do. But so, so cute. I used the My Favorite Things Tag Builder Blueprints 5 dies. <clears throat> I really, really am liking those. I used some uh, not too shabby blue florals 6x6 paper. Um, this is from the April 2022 Paper Pad Club. Um, I did not see it in the shop anymore, but it is still just such a gorgeous paper pad. And then I did make a shaker tag, so I used Moonstone, this calls for confetti. In hindsight, it went a little bit um, more like blue than I wanted it to be, but it still turned out okay. <clears throat> and here is my little shaker tag. Look at that little sheep with that little piggy. Oh my goodness, so, so cute. And I used that ribbon that I absolutely love, my favoriteest ribbon in the world. I'm glad I bought a little bit extra of that when it was available. And so then it shakes. I think on this one I should have added one more layer because the this calls for cur, this calls for confetti gets stuck a little bit, but it still turned out adorable. And in case you missed it, the way that I've been making my shaker tags is that I cut like this time I did six layers of the like I do one layer for the base. Oh, I was asked to show the back. It's just back to with some cardstock. So I do one layer for the base. <clears throat> I do one layer. This one actually cuts out like the little squares. So I have that square there for that pattern paper. And then I do layers for to create the depth instead of foam tape. So I did six or seven layers. I think I should have done just a few more to let those uh, confetti pieces shake a little bit easier. But it's still super adorable. And like I said, they kind of caught more blue than I really wanted them to. But in the end, I love it. And I'm sure anyone who receives it will love it as well. So there is my day five tag. And I hope that you are enjoying this series. I am. And I will see you back here tomorrow for day six. Have an amazing day and go get crafty. Why not make a tag? Bye.